it's new tool day, or at least the day that I'm sharing the new tool with all of you. Um, if you're not into tools, this might not be the video for you, but if you're a chainsaw carver and you like tools, or maybe you're just into chainsaws, or maybe you're just interested in knowing what I use to uh, carve my pieces, I found an Echo 2511P, which is, P means it's a rear handle rather than a top handle. If you're into chainsaws, you know what that is. Um, but let me tell you what's so great about this saw. Number one, it's normally a $500 chainsaw. It's considered a professional grade saw. And I paid 300 bucks for it because if any of you know me, you know that I'm cheap. So anytime I can save money, most of my shop has been filled with tools that I've bought pre-owned and they all serve me really well. And if you're a business owner, controlling cost is key. If you can't control cost, you're not in business. But uh, so affordable, but let me tell you what I really love about this saw. It's light. This saw with a 14 inch bar is two and a half pounds lighter than my steel MS-170 with a 12 inch dime tip carving bar. And you might not think that two and a half pounds sounds like a lot, but it's huge. It's a massive difference. I'm super excited um, to save that weight. It means that I'm saving the wear on my body and uh, yeah, I'm just excited about it. I think this could use a little bit more power. So I'm gonna do a few modifications, modify the muffler, tune it a little bit. I feel like there's more power in there. I feel like that it's probably running a little fat right now and that I can lean it up just a little bit um, and get some more power out of it. But otherwise, it, I always say I will give up power to save weight any day. And um, I'm excited because this is equally as powerful, maybe not a little more powerful than the MS-170 and a lot lighter. So again, new to me, pretty excited, super, super excited actually, if you can't tell. And I've been running this uh, quite a bit. Love it so far. Can't wait to uh, put some more hours on it. I do have an eight inch. So if you can imagine, this is a 14 inch. Uh, shave six inches off of this thing. I've got an eight inch dime tip carving bar and a quarter inch sprocket and 043 gauge chain. If you're not a chainsaw nerd, those numbers mean nothing to you. But if you are, you know that that's going to that's gonna make this saw into an epic little detail saw. Um, I like it so much that I'm planning on buying another one of these um, to run a 12 inch bar on. So yeah, uh, super excited to add to the fleet of saws and uh, always happy to score a good deal. Hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Take care.